The National Hunt Flat Race is next end, two miles on one furlong this time, so a little bit longer today. And the top one is Take a Look for David Hooley, William Tell for Ryan Tamasebi, Bronx Babe for Paul Rhodes, Duhas Leon Van Rinsburg, Port Elizabeth for Paul Rhodes, Silent Fortunata, Craig Allen, She's Electric, Derek Hinton, Talbia Save, Dan Hughes and the Goddess for Joshua Sutherland. So just nine of them again then, probably the same nine that ran last week if we're honest, and away they go. And... Port Elizabeth might just about be the first to show Bronx Bame also to the fore, but it's almost four or five on a line, isn't it? To start with the grey Port Elizabeth pulling for a head and keen to lead, it would seem, from Bronx Bame. She's electric for Derek Hinton, who likes to have a winner in these National Hunt flat races. Biggest surprise of the lot is the man that champions these the most. Graham Clutterbuck hasn't got one in it. And it's Port Elizabeth, who is in the lead by about two lengths to William Tell and take a look. And then she's electric and do hast with the goddess and Bronx babe and then Tal we are saved and finally Silent Fortunata. So making their way to the final three quarters of a mile then. And Port Elizabeth, the only grey in the field, is leading by two lengths to take a look in the purple jacket second. William Talwater on the far side in the red is third, then the pink and black of Derek Hinton with She's Electric with Joshua Sutherland's red and black of the goddess just being partially hidden by Leon Van Rensburg's Duhast with the gold cap behind that one, Bronx Babe the second for Paul Rhodes and then the back two are Silent Fortune Arts of a Greg Allen and Tal Beer saved right over on the far side it's just a back marker but it's Port Elizabeth then who's going to race past the water jump and past the winning post and we're about to swing left handed then this turn won't cause so many problems in the National Hunt Flat Race with only nine of them and Port Elizabeth is now two or three lengths clear. Off take a look in second and William Tell third. The Goddess is now a clear fourth. Then comes She's Electric. Do has just drop back a little bit. Then Bronx Babe and Silent Fortunata and Tal Beer saved as a couple of lengths adrift of the remainder then. As they continue on their way down this back straight. And Port Elizabeth. The grey showing a clean pair of heels to the rest of them so far. Take a look. He's taking a look at those heels and the goddess is alongside that one in third. Gap back to William Tell and Silent Fortunata and she's electric and do has to almost four in a line. Then Bronx Babe is just behind them and a couple of lengths behind them. He's Talbia saved the back marker but not necessarily too far out of the back to be involved in the finish. And Port Elizabeth is in front. A good two and a half length to the goddess is now second. Take a look third. Do has moving up on the outside in fourth. William Tell is after that. Bronx Babe just being pushed between those two then to come with a bit of a run now and he's going to burst through into second I think. It's Port Elizabeth in the lead. Stable companion Bronx Babe trying to move into second. Take a look on the inside is third. Do has on the outside is four. Then the goddess. She's electric. William Tell. Silent Fortunata. Tell being safe. Now got a bit to do and he's about five lengths adrift but Port Elizabeth races into the final four furlongs then with a clear lead of two lengths. The stable mate Bronx Babe looks to be going better though. Do Hast is in third. Take a look under a bit of pressure in fourth. She's electric trying to run on again. The goddess is still there. Doesn't look like he's moved on William Tell yet. That one's going to need some room though. Silent Fortunata is going to try and come round the whole lot of them. Tal being saved is out of it. It's Port Elizabeth then into the final two and a half furlong. Still clear by two and a half. To Do Hast who's now a clear second. She's electric starting to run on the outside. Bronx Babe fluttered to deceive. Then comes Take a Look. William Tell now needs to get going. The goddess is flat foot in Silent Fortunata's not got going at all we're inside the final furlong now then and it's Port Elizabeth Port Elizabeth still in front from Duhas she's electric he's beginning to eat up the ground but Port Elizabeth is still in front with half a furlong to go it's Port Elizabeth holding on from Duhas and she's electric and Port Elizabeth looks like he's going to be a pillar to post of a Paul Rose at the post it's Port Elizabeth that takes it Duhas and she's electric take a look William Tell and Bronx Bay but all the way back to Tal Beer saved at the Flat trainer extraordinaire takes the National Hunt flat race and Port Elizabeth is the one he's done it with. It looked like Bronx Bay would come through to take it, but that one just went out really quickly. And one or two of them never really got going at all today. And Port Elizabeth takes it for Paul Rhodes. Do has to a second for Leon Van Rensburg. She's electric. Looked like it was going to make a good go at it for a while in third for Derek Hinton. Take a look for David Hood. He was fourth. William Tell for Ryan Tamasevi was fifth. A bit disappointing today, that one.